Today we're comparing 274 grams of AMFO with 274 of C4. So AMFO has a velocity of around 14,000 feet per second. And a lot of people say in my videos, oh, is that Tannerite or AMFO? That is way too slow for most of my applications. C4 has a velocity of around 26,000 feet per second. And today we're gonna demonstrate the difference on an artillery shell. Let's put ANFO up first and see how it does. What Beth is doing is taping the ANFO onto this artillery shell. This ANFO is sensitized. In other words, most of the time ANFO is known as a blasting agent, it requires a booster. But in this case, a single detonator is able to set it off. And you're gonna see, it's not gonna do too much to that metal. Whoa. A little bit of a blast damage in the grass in this area right here but it did nothing to the metal. In fact, some of the plastic is still on here from the bag. Now that's all gonna be different with the C4. The C4 is much faster at 26,000 feet per second compared to 14,000. This has a lot more brisance. I'm not gonna put a shape charge hollow uh, cone inside of here or anything. I'm gonna put it straight on here and I promise you it's gonna be different. Oh. definitely was a different result. This hole that you're looking at was from a previous test. And as I roll it over, I see this bulging pimple right here with fresh broken steel. What that tells me is that it was hit by a projectile and that projectile was the other side. This Woo! is what you get with a high velocity explosive in direct contact with steel. It caused a chunk to be cut out, threw it so hard to the other side that it almost broke through. That's C4 for you. 